Okay, so so are we gonna talk about Juneteenth or no? Uh, what about Juneteenth? What are we talking about with Juneteenth? We're talking about the, the, the talking about the Walmart ice cream that got put off the shelf. Yeah, the ice creams. I saw it. I didn't see what the backlash was because I saw there was backlash, but so like, I, it, it, it goes that 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 goes into what the just hopped up. Oh, okay, it's the video I just downloaded out of Dropbox. It's, it's more so uh, the video done. So so listen. So here's 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 the TLDR. Here's the simplified version of this. So here's what happened. So Walmart thought because now it's a federal recognized holiday, they thought they were gonna do something inclusive and they were gonna make some some ice cream for black people, Juneteenth ice cream, but make it great value as well. Mm-hmm. Just Don't listen to how first, stupid this is. First, first of all, that that shows you what you really think of us. Okay, you put us on a great value. You ain't even make us no just no regular ice cream. You had to slap the great value sticker on there. You know what I'm saying? Like, like no, no. First of all, first of all, our holiday is not uh, on discount. Okay, this is a, we are a full blown holiday. All right, you will give us our own freaking end cap. Okay, I want to see the memorabilia. I want balloons. I want candles. I want the whole shebang, okay, that y'all normally do. I want the same rollout, okay, the same place where you put the Valentine's Day stuff, you put the Saturn Patrick's Day stuff, your seasonal cap, that end cap. I want that whole thing. I want the same damn thing. But yet they thought they would just get by with slapping some ice cream in there. And you got all these other stores. They're like, oh, we're going to do this Juneteenth thing and this Juneteenth thing, blah, 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 blah. And hey, you're free now. No, that's not how this works. Still, still, for the love of God, if you have a black friends, just shut up. Just shut up that day. Just shut up. Oh. You can ask questions and try and learn something, but do I'm not be in there talking about some happy Juneteenth, y'all. No, no, no. That's no, it's gonna come off the completely wrong way. That is not the delivery. That is not what you want. You don't want to be that guy that day. Hmm. Um, wait, 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 wait. Are we live? Yeah, it's on Twitch. Yeah. I mean, I'm, but we're not gonna do this on YouTube. I mean, yeah, we're gonna do this on YouTube. It's just gonna be its own thing. That the do you want to do it now? Or, or I'm, I'm saying you were doing the rant. I was gonna, I'm saying you're doing the rant. I was going to respond, but I can say what I'm going to say if we're going to record it. Yeah, just 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 talk. We're talking still. Just just go. Yeah, but I want to say I don't want to repeat the same shit. No, on, you don't have to repeat. It. Just talk. I'm literally telling you, I'm going to make this its own thing. Oh, so yes. So you're, you're, you're not right. recording. You're not recording on YouTube. We right are now. recording right now. No, so he's already so. He's not recording on YouTube, but he's he's recording. So what he's gonna do is what what we have right now. He's gonna cut it oh, and, and, and okay, make it make it into bad. its own thing. Cut, yes. cut, cut everything out. I just said my bad. So I here's know. my issue. You're making me have more work. <laughs> I didn't know, bro. I'm, we've never done it this way. I'm sorry. You confused me. I'm sorry. God. My bad. Go with the go. Go with All the right. Go. So here, here's here here's how I feel about it. Okay. There's a couple of things going on here. One. <laughs> They obviously these companies are using I, I don't like when they capitalize off of things just to make money. Like they're taking mm-hmm. product simple products and slapping Juneteenth on it. And have you seen the one that's it's the freedom for me? Excuse me. I'm sorry, what? And and yeah, they're using, yeah, it, that as, one. They're using that it as one. a marketing tactic to make money, but I don't even it's know if they understand. For me. don't even really understand what Juneteenth this. This is an insult, right? So then you you have this, like you said, this 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 ice cream, and you slap a Juneteenth label on it, and you're like, oh, this is June, your Juneteenth ice cream because it has the colors of the the, the Pan African <laughs> flag, right? And it's just, it's 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 very insulting because you're literally doing this just to just to make sales like would you would you make a holocaust ice cream like wh- wh- no i bet you wouldn't like but, but, come on but but to play devil's advocate they did make a fourth of july ice cream that's not the same no no no, 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 no. i i might i'm not i'm not saying it's the same i'm 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 just cuz i cuz i will say this sometimes stuff with the best intentions get morphed into something totally 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 wrong so- so, so I'm gonna I'm gonna clarify, right? So there's a this is difference between a commercialized holiday and a holiday mm-hmm. that is that res, is is to remember and and mm-hmm. keep things in mind, right? Mm-hmm. Juneteenth is to honor those who were officially freed from slavery. Mm-hmm. It's not to 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 go have a well, I mean, black people, yes, but it's mm-hmm. not for it's not for the white people to go out here and 
make these dumbass products and mm-hmm. and and mock us and make us feel like we're we're, we're going two hundred years back, right? Now July fourth is like a a February fourteenth, like a Valentine's Day. Mm-hmm. It's it's a Christmas now. It's a Thanksgiving, but also they like the difference between like for instance Veterans Day. You don't see people. You don't see people out here. Oh, we're celebrating the people that die. Like, no, this is not. This is not well, that, cool. And I, well, but 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 because and and this is where I say I think unfortunately, every holiday has been commercialized beyond belief. So and and this is where I say and I'm I'm I do not justify what they did, but I'm playing devil's advocate because would you be more insulted if they said hey and left it alone? Because the thing is Memorial Day. They have fucking car sales and everything like that, and they do all this stuff like that. And we have barbecues and do the shit for the military, and they, they commercialize Memorial Day. They do the same thing for Veterans Day. I so, think I think the difference is mm-hmm. that this is a there's different ways to go about it. There's a couple of things going on here, right? Mm-hmm. So this is a holiday for Black people. This is mm-hmm. not for white CEOs to be like, hey, go buy this ice cream. <laughs> no, like this is the time where you highlight your 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 black uh, uh contractors mm-hmm. your black and, and the black um consulting agencies that you partner with and mm-hmm. and the black uh employees that are doing an amazing job on your team there's a there's a better way to go about this so the backlash to the ice cream was oh instead of you you designating something as a juneteenth ice cream why don't you just highlight black businesses that are already making ice cream so no, so now yeah. now there is a black hmm? Walmart now there's a black woman who owns an ice cream brand, and they have pushed her product and be like, "Hey, go!" She and she owns she has the same exact flavors that they created for Juneteenth yeah. ice cream. Oh, ice cream. That, you still support that, her brand. Yeah, no, tar- Target did that. That's what I'm saying because it's, yeah. it's it's it. But I'm saying that that's where you have different you have different CEOs. But I think the problem with Juneteenth is, and this is the thing that sucks about it. Once you make something a federal holiday, it's no longer for one race. And that's where I'll disagree with you on, on there too, because if it was like Kwanzaa or anything else like that, because 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 and that's the thing, because even or even if it's recognized, but you, but you don't, it's not a federal holiday like Cinco de Mayo, because because Cinco de Mayo is pretty much the same thing, but it's not a federal holiday. Hmm. So then, if you do Cinco de Mayo and you want and you want to do stuff for um to help out Hispanic heritage, that's one thing. But once you make it a federal holiday, because St. Patrick's Day. Is it, 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 it that's another holiday? But it's the same thing, but it's not it's not federally recognized. I, unfortunately, once you make something federally mandated, because that's the thing, Christmas and Easter. No, I'll say mostly Christmas. Christmas is for Christians and Catholics, but everybody gets it. So and I, so and no and and that's and that that's my that's my stance on it. So. And I, cause I said, I was, I think, and I knew about Juneteenth. I know about Kwanzaa. I was, you know, I grew up with that and to understand the, the importance of all, for all of that. But once you make yeah. it a federal holiday and say, Hey, it's for everybody now, this is the shit that happens. You get it, especially when, and this is my problem with it last year. Cause last year I felt like it was such a knee jerk reaction. No one got to learn about it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So yeah, very, I, I, very I last think minute. It, oh. So, yeah. So listen. So listen. So listen. So listen. Look, if you're gonna if you're gonna learn anything about about if you're gonna go out here on a limb and try to sell a product, okay, okay, you could at least like, especially in Walmart's case, it was much easier for them. That same in cap that I was talking about, you can literally just put the black businesses that are selling in Walmart on the in cap. That's exactly. It. That's it, and just That's say happy. All, they had to all do. you had to do was say happy Juneteenth. But, but that you, was it. That was, it, was, but, it was that. It was that I, simple. They had yeah. an easy layup, an easy layup. But you but, know what happened? So listen. So listen. So hold on, hold on. I'm just gonna get on Walmart's ass real quick because yeah. I'm from Arkansas and I just need to. So listen. They are in Rogers, Arkansas, surrounded by 97 percent white people. Okay, most of their headquarters, their employees are white people. So they're probably the PR person. But, that, that thought this was a good idea was a white person. Didn't run it by none of the black people in the office. None of them. Y'all have black people that work there. I have a friend that works there. Um, you, you didn't think to, you know what, saying Like, hey, let me ask the black people that I work with, is this a good idea? Would people get behind it? Like, 
No, the headquarters just said, yo, we're going to push this out here and not ask nobody. You had plenty of opportunity and time, but you failed epically because you are prepared. You don't care what black people think. But you I'll put it that way, though. Hold on, hold on. 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 Wait, wait, wait. So listen, all they care about is our dollars, okay? Yes. What the family cares about is our dollars. They don't Thank care you. about us, period. Thank you. I know that. Thank you. But Thank but you. I'm but I'm gonna I'm say this to though. The audience. Yeah, no, but but I will say this though. A lot of black people don't don't know what the fuck Juneteenth is. So I'm I mean, saying yeah. so so I'm I saying mean, yeah, the people yeah, okay. that that, right, that, right. that they ask, they're like, I don't no, know. So, no, 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 they know. Wait, they well, would have asked well, let them. me. They have people. Well, let me add here. something. Yeah, especially, especially after the jo- the George Flo- Floyd incident, right? All these companies took a DEI stand. It was like we're going to do a better part at our end. Mm-hmm. So almost every damn company has a DEI uh, um, a department now. There mm-hmm. is somebody in DEI that they could have talked to and be like, "Hey, what kind of marketing strategy should we use for Juneteenth?" And they would have mm-hmm. been like, "Oh, just highlight the black own the black owned products." But no. Guess what? Whoever is the white is 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 white in yeah. their mind thought this was harmless. It's like I'm gonna let's create ice cream because, like, because, because no one because no one knows because they're they're treating it like that's every, why it's important to have yeah. black people on your team to no, help you out. I I understand, but the thing is too. But this this is the issue. One, we all know the people they don't like black people on, on our fucking team because of of what we talked about earlier, a freaking the social class, and they said no, we're we're, we're beneath them. So that that's one thing. Two, the the other thing is 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 we did it without any education. So they're treating it like any other fucking holiday, and mm-hmm. I, and I, and that's that's the issue. Because and the thing is because and because we're we're, we're saying Juneteenth, it's really really significant, but we're also treating it like a celebration. So from the from the regular lens, they're saying oh celebration. Ice cream, party favors, all like that too. Wine, fun stuff. Because I thought the wine was fucking ridiculous. And and and, wait, and, wait, and there I, was Juneteenth wine. Yes. No. I didn't no. know that either. No. no. Why don't you highlight, you highlight black girl magic? Like, come on, y'all. No, be, be, because 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 that because that's something that they do specifically for a certain thing, and and that's and that's where I'm saying they didn't te- they didn't do anything outside the fucking box. Because it because they just said copy paste mm-hmm. because they hit Juneteenth celebration celebration let's do this and, and I think that's just the, that's just the issue and but I think it goes back to how how everything happened last year mm-hmm. when they're like oh because it was literally last minute and like oh mm-hmm. now Juneteenth's a holiday mm-hmm. and it was really no significance because the time where we could talk about the the, the significance of Juneteenth everybody was fucking off work. Mm-hmm. And because I know it was super last minute because I was actually in the class and we didn't know. So we so we actually worked Juneteenth and then they gave us the Monday off. Because and, and so that's what I'm saying. That's how last minute it everything was. And then so and the people in my class who were there was only one other black person in my class, they're, they're kind of asking us, so oh, like what's Juneteenth? Hmm. Because no one's really done done a great job at explaining what it is, how, why is it symbolic, what does it represent? And then even even if you do a certain way, they're like, "Oh, hey, you know," and and they're like, "Celebration." And ladies and gentlemen, this is why you must fight against those school boards that are vote that are trying to change your history books. Okay, you must fight to keep all the black history in the history books as well as add in the black history that matters. Okay, you must do that. You must take it upon yourself. Okay, and if your school district for some reason will not do so, and they will not listen to you and your counsel. You need to educate your children. It is your responsibility as black people. All right. Simon. To, Simon to black educate, people. To educate, no, no, no. To educate. I'm just talking about just black people in general to educate themselves. Just offer it. Okay. It's our holiday. We should know. I think you, know it's every, you, you don't have to, you don't have to, you don't have to go run around to Hispanic people and explain Cinco de Mayo or their holidays. No, well, we know. no the things people, they, they don't, they, they don't even know what Cinco de Mayo is. So I, I I would like to Have highlight. You, I'm saying in Spanish because because what is Cinco de Mayo to you? 
Who to me? I nothing. All I know is people eat tacos and that's it. Yes. There's a history it's, behind it. I forgot though. There's no, a history. It, there's, it, it, it goes with the independence of Mexico. It's when, it's when like the Mexicans get freed or something like that, right? Yeah. So and yeah. and and, and yeah. that and and so and that's what I'm saying because the the issue was for so yeah. long. Juneteenth was seen like that, and the thing is, like with Cinco de Mayo, a lot of people they don't they don't even know what that means, and I mean that's why. But with a lot of stuff, but when it, and I get what you're saying, I get what you're saying. So, and yeah, I, I, I think like the main thing is that when I say not just Black history, it's fucking American history because American history is yeah. um because the good and the bad, and even with the and since we don't learn about the bad history, we don't know the the significance of Juneteenth. And the thing is, Cinco, Cinco de Mayo, it, it's, it's, uh, it symbolizes it was um, Mexico. They, um, it was like their second victory all over the French. <clears throat> or, the, or no, the, or no um, mm. sorry, the, the second French Empire. Sorry. So, yeah, so they, they beat the Empire. So it's kind of like their, like their independence. But that's the thing. But, oh, but, but, but it's so freaking warped. And I think that's what happened with, June, with Juneteenth. And, and that's because people, they just don't know the history. Sorry, that's just the history of um, mm -hmm. the history buffing me. Well, there's also this product that that um, it says it's the freedom for me, which mm. lets me know they know what this 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 holiday uh, means. No, I, they know what it means. No, I, I know that they know what it means, but they, they don't understand the, the gravity of it. But they don't the care. Yeah. They okay. don't care. That's what they they don't don't care. Care. And that's what I mean. No one cares about any holiday because once it's federal, they just don't care. And that's what I mean by everything else. Like they know what it is because when you look at the when you look at the ice cream, mm -hmm. you look at the pictures on it. They know, like they know what this holiday is. Mm -hmm. They know exactly they know what the color scheme and arrow. Yeah, they know. They know what it is. I'm sure they look. You can you can Google it, and the first thing that comes up on Wikipedia. No, I, I no, I get what you're saying, and I'm saying, like we said, I'm saying they don't care because they don't care because people don't care, and and, so, care and luckily them. with this one. Well, 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 hold on though. I do. I what what I really want to bring light to is, I do think that sometimes as black people we don't stick together. However, this time we came together, and Walmart pulled it from their shelves. So now you can lo no longer get this ice cream from the shelves because they got they had the backlash from black people and they. Had, Mm -hmm. Release their apology, whatever, and, and and I'm happy to hear that. That also shows hey. how powerful we are. Yes. Hey, that apology was had me cry. Right. It was so simple. They ain't drag it out nothing. We sincerely apologize. That's when you know you fucked up. You just they, like, they hey, they were like, hey, let me, hey, hey, throw that, out. hey, give me that ice cream, throw that outside. But but like you said, I'm glad. Like you said, I'm glad we did come together and say yes. this is appalling. But yes. but and, and sorry, I'm I think I'm attacking the bigger issue because I think one I year of a holiday, a one year of a holiday mm -hmm. with no explanation. That's the thing; they still really don't explain anything of it too. And it's been a fucking year. We knew it was coming, and it's like, and there's still no certain things to go, for us to learn the history about about shit. But I yeah. but because that's my thing with a lot, a lot of these I'm fucking holidays. Busy. There's like they just bury the meaning and and they hide because we hide St. Patrick's Day behind freaking alcohol. We we hide Cinco de Mayo behind freaking be, be behind freaking tacos. I wouldn't be surprised yeah. that in five years we hide Juneteenth behind fucking ribs. Fuck <laughs> yeah, oh, I like ribs. God. I mean, I'm not gonna <laughs> lie to you. Right, I, look, look, look. I'm not gonna lie to you. I live in DC. Juneteenth be popping around here. It be all kinds of barbecues, gay parties. Be no, no. It's yeah, and, and that's why, but We're so I'm saying, up. so once that moves over, and then because I think it's like because now Cinco de Mayo, it's not, it's like, yeah, it's celebrated by the Hispanics, but it's commercialized. So then everywhere has, has a thing, and out here, you know, I got the gringos coming out here, freaking getting tacos, going to the taco bars, so like that, too. So I wouldn't <laughs> be surprised in five to ten years, you know, I get what you're saying, I get what you're saying, yeah. and, and I think that's in a so. so so I just hope that that we don't lose the meaning, or at least people people they'll be more accepting. But because but I didn't remember even getting the boat across last year too. It's like wow, imagine being so racist that you, you don't want to you, you don't want to pay day off because that, that's how I felt last year. Mm -hmm. And people use excuses a, like oh, that's a good way to end this. That's a that's a really good yeah, way. To that, end that, that 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 that's right there. All right, so listen, y'all like, comment, and subscribe. I. Right. Mm, uh, mm, mm.